Good morning everyone, hope you're doing well. Yesterday I asked if I should show you the after army effect of a Rattle 90s heat round on a T55. In this case we're looking at the T55A. Now based on the availability of information regarding this Cold War Classic, um, the model is very very accurate uh, as well as the statistics regarding the 19 millimeters performance i think the only people will be able to tell you what uh, the the performance are is better than the simulation will probably be the people who work with the ammunition tests themselves now i think before we have a look at the simulation itself let's look at the layout of the t55a on the right hand side of the vehicle you have the primary fuel tank and then two secondary fuel tanks uh, behind that is ammunition and then fuel again you have the engine towards the rear uh, the driver is seated on the front left uh, in the crew compartment you have the gunner front commanded behind him and the loader in the right rear of the turret it's very cramped all right let's have a look at the armor itself uh, directly front frontally you have a uh, hundred millimeters thick uh, frontal glazes plate um, at this angle it is equivalent to 179 millimeters and at the bottom you have a similar thick thickness plate and it is effective to 204 millimeters of protection looking at the cost homogeneous armored hull or turret I beg your pardon um, it's variable thickness because of its shape directly from the front it offers 201 millimeters uh, of uh, armor uh, the further out you go on the two the cheeks uh, the armor effectively becomes more because of the angle so let's have a look at the let's do a protection analysis I've pre-selected uh, the Rattle 90 uh, the OCC 6062 ammunition which is the heat uh, fin stabilized um, as you can see because it's a heat round it's uh, not the same as the fin rounds used by the the elephant um, it its penetration is based on the size of the warhead in the front um, so at a zero degree angle whether it's 10 meters or two kilometers the penetration is still 320 millimeters um, and if you think of the armor analysis we just did uh, it's my uh, it's sufficient to penetrate on a zero degree if you move to 30 degrees the penetration goes down to 277 and at 60 degrees it's 160 millimeters so let's do the test so frontally uh, we can start on the right hand side of the vehicle it penetrates the fuel tanks located on the right on the center of the vehicle it penetrates the crew compartment uh, missing the driver uh, shooting the driver's left hand side you kill the driver most probably gonna kill the driver the gunner and the commander let's look at the turret itself let's start on the left again uh, so anything probably directly from the front on the right hand cheek um, under the IR light is a non pen moving to the searchlight uh, then you kill the the loader moving to the gunner side you will kill the the gunner and the commander and again on the cheeks anything past these uh, exterior features is a non pen okay let's have a look um, uh, as you can see if you if you change the angle if it's directly from the front and you shoot it on the cheeks you don't pin if you if you change the angle the armor th effective armor thickness becomes less so if you shoot the turret from the left hand side you penetrate you take out the, the gunner the the breech um, directly from the sides same story 
if you can shoot the T55A from the rear you will most probably cook off the ammunition uh, on the left hand side, uh, sorry right hand side center catastrophic damage in the interior of the turret front right you'll take out the breach now the hull on the sides we didn't have a look at but the effective form of thickness uh, between the tracks and the upper hull is 85 uh, 82 millimeters uh, solid penetration no problems there likewise on the other side as well um, if you have any questions or you would like to me to do another analysis with another South African vehicle um, if it's available I will gladly do so so looking forward to hearing from you and trading some information cheers take care